Hello everybody and welcome back to another Gaming Cat episode and today we're going to be starting another new Minecraft series and it's called Comicraft. Um, I don't know how YouTube will respond to this, maybe they won't like it and if they don't like it, it will be called Kermitcraft or some other stupid name or something like that. But I figure in this episode we're going to get the basics, get a bed and sleep in our little dirt hole in the side of a mouse. Um, I'm not sure how long this will go, but I guess we'll see, and it's going to be survival, it's going to be difficulty, normal, and it's pretty much just going to be all basic, create new world. Okay, so this is the world of Kamikraft, and we spawned right next to a village, that is excellent, because then we can take these villagers and put them in little jail cells, and we can be true to our religion and we can make them do all the work and they get nothing except for protection. Oh, he just became a farmer. Thank you, I will harvest your wheat and sell it back to you later. But for now, we got to, I guess, start punching trees. I don't necessarily wanna live in a villager house. I wanna make my own house, but the village is a good thing to have around. So we're gonna start by punching this house. Um, yeah, don't look at me. I'm just gonna get some wood here. Don't. He's staring at me and he's making me uncomfortable. But we're just gonna keep punching this tree and um, then we're gonna make the basic supplies and make a pickaxe and then only use it for three times and then get some stone. So this seems to be a fairly big village. I'm not super happy that I spawned here, but oh, I almost just died. And there's a creeper already. Kamikraft are trying to kill me. Um, but we can go up into the mountains. I am just looking. That's a good spot. That is where we're going to build our hole. Not even a hobbit hole. Literally just a door inside of the mountain. But we're going to try and need to make a little bit of a better way to get over here. Because jumping like that probably isn't going to cut it. So we're going to make all of these into planks. And get some sticks out. And we're going to make our very small wooden pickaxe and make a couple more um, sticks. Now that we got this, we're gonna use it improperly to mine out some dirt and we're gonna go, and this is gonna be where the start of our home is gonna be. Or I guess it's not even a home, it's a temporary apartment kind of thing. But anyways, I guess that means we can already start here with a stone pickaxe which is pretty good. And I'm just gonna clear this house out really quickly and I'll get back to you guys when the whole inside part is actually cleared out. Okay, so I made it a little bit big, but that shouldn't be a problem because bigger is better. Um, we got pumpkins already. I don't know if I'm gonna use them, but we need torches. And look at that, we got coal right here. So we're gonna go mine off this coal a little bit. And I guess we'll do a little first person time lapse for what the rest of these are. I have to fix that. Why don't we do that right now? Perfect. Alright, time lapse starting now. Okay. Um, we're done with that. Alright, get out of here, you little rats. Go away. Alright. So now that that's done, we can make um, some torches. Not a lot. I don't want to waste all my coal. I want to keep most of it for other stuff, which isn't very... Expl I'm not explaining it super good, but we're going to make a sword, and we're going to go raid this village and get a bed, because I said we needed a bed, and a bed we shall get, so we're going to get a nice blue bed, I feel like. That's, a, that's pretty good, and I just want to make sure that this is actually outside the village. Um, I wonder where to look actually, biome. Well, let's say, oh, this is a river technically, I guess. Um, I don't know if it tells me I'm in the village. Uh, I'm just gonna guess I am, so I guess that's all right. Um, and there we are, our bed's place, our respawn point is there, so if we die, we won't lose too much stuff, but I'm not really planning to die 
in the first day. I almost died a bit earlier, and that is very close to the trees. The trees will catch on fire if I do not do anything about it. But I will do anything about it. I'll trust that my citizens that love me very, very much will think, Oh, wait, we're, we're going to burn down. But they probably won't. Anyway, we're going to steal a saddle. Well, that's pretty good, actually. They're decently rare since you can't really craft them. And then it looks like we got a cave system. Nice. We'll have to explore that maybe later in this episode. Some potatoes and pumpkin seeds. Sweet berries. I'll take the spruce ones, just in case we want to start a tree farm. Mm, this is blast furnace. Nothing that I really want from there. But actually, this is a really big village. I think I said that already, but I'm going to say it again. Because it's from all the way over there, all the way down here. I think this is the furthest house away from where I spawned, which was actually right over there. And the villagers stuck in the hole. Sir, why did, why did you go in the hole and get yourself stuck? There you go. You can get out now. Um, here's another house. Ooh. I want to collect some of those. Oh my gosh, we already got some iron gear. That is pretty lucky. And we got um, a food source. It's not a great food source because it kills me when I try and walk over it. But it looks like there's a grindstone there. Great, because I can never, ever remember how to craft those. But it looks like I won't. Ooh, and we got a blacksmith. That's probably who I stole. Oh, coal. That's pretty good. I feel like that's pretty good at least. We could give him some of the coal since there's quite a bit of coal around here. So, I mean, we could give him one. I didn't have a lot of coal. That's all right. Just one more piece of iron for my collection. Or, I mean emerald. It's not iron. It's emerald. Um, I believe I have been here before. That is incorrect. Oh, I got another emerald. Sweet. I almost have enough to get a pickaxe. I mean, uh, just an iron axe. This is a pretty handy spawn, actually, because we're right by the village. So we get all the good stuff of the villagers. But I did not want to live in the villagers' house because they smell a little bad. Oh, that it would be enough... Um, that's enough emeralds. Okay. Um, after I finish looting, we can go and get an iron axe. Iron. I haven't even gone mining yet, and I already have more than half of um, iron gear. Actually, why don't we put that on? Yeah, I just need a chest plate. It's interesting. I didn't have a chest plate. I think I've looted almost all the homes except for you. What do you got? You got more bread. Okay. It's a good amount of food, and I'm getting hungry because I'm sprinting around like I don't care about my hunger. Um, and I think he was down here. I think we have to go to bed soon. But if I'm correct, his house is right over here. I hope he's still down here. I don't want to go hunting for him again. Um, I don't know where he went. Is he in his house? I hear a zombie. What was that? Well, this is a cool little cave. I don't want to explore it quite yet. I don't have enough stuff. I'll explore it in the next episode. Or maybe in this episode. I don't know. I just need to find where the heck he went. Oh my gosh, there's a Fletcher. Oh, um, I'm going to take that from you. There you are. Thank you. So now that we got an iron axe on day one, episode one, I am actually pretty pleased. Um, I've looted pretty much everything in the village. So now I think I can go back and sort stuff out. Yeah, I got quite a bit of, I got quite a bit. I did not mean to do that. I got a lot of spruce wood. So I'm going to make two chests so I can have one large chest in my house. There we are. Um, we should move the crafting table inside the house and it looks like it's getting dark. So, oops, did not mean to place it there. I'm going to craft a door, I think. I'm gonna get three doors. I like these doors, but we will upgrade eventually because they are not the best. We got five, 
So we're just gonna take four. Cause I don't wanna waste all of my resources quite yet. And we're gonna put them right next to the bed. So we won't get too cold during the night. Although I'm not too worried about that happening. So we're just gonna split these, these all up. And we're gonna put them in each. It's not a lot of cold, but it will do. And when we wake up in the morning, We'll go around here and we'll gather up some of that stuff with our stone pickaxe. Um, so I'm going to sleep real quickly and I'm going to wake up and then we'll go get some more coal. Okay, so the coal looked like it was on the other side. So I'm going to go to the other side and see what I see. Because coal is pretty useful. Oh, there's some right there. And doesn't look- oh my lord, that's a lot of bad guys. I'm not good fighting creepers, especially when there's two of them. And the villager- villager, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, what are you doing? It's not very bright. Oh my gosh. That took a while. So we're going to put that over here, and we're just going to quickly run around here. And light it up. I think they can still spawn there, but it will stop a little bit. I was less than. I was like next to nothing. <laughs> All right, whatever. I don't. Oh, what are you on? I feel like you're. What's underneath? Oh, a hay bale. I may or may not take that. Oh, there's more coal right over here. I'm just gonna take all of it, and I won't trade this stuff because. I want to have stuff for other people. Okay, so I'm just gonna finish getting up all this coal. And then we'll go back and I'm not sure what we're really gonna do once I get back. All right, there we are. We got five levels already. That is, I feel like that's pretty good, but um, I feel like I should start construction soon on a house. Oh, I did not mean to fall down here. Oh, wow, this is a big cave. Um, yeah, I'm going to collect this stuff first because this stuff's pretty important early game. Okay, so then we have that. Dude, are you still down here? Are you stuck? Oh my gosh, I think he was actually stuck on something. Well, I guess it's a good thing I wanted to say hi to him. Um, I actually don't have any more torches. Oh, look at that. The cave stops there. Okay, um, I explored a pretty good amount, but I think I still want to keep going more in here. Because, did I, did you got, I just put it in there. Okay, whatever. So... This cave looks like it's a pretty big cave, actually, so we could look out. I'm not seeing too much of anything, really, though. So that's concerning. So there's nothing over there. What about down this way? Nothing, not even coal. There's no this is a horrible cave. There's nothing in this cave. It wouldn't even make for a good house because it's too not long. It's not fat enough. It's like a hallway. It's a hallway of disappointments. Okay, so now is that done? I don't really think there are much more caves around here. What in the hunk is that? Um, I'm not really sure, so I'm just gonna pop myself up here. I think it's just a really deformed grass block thingy. Huh, interesting. Okay, so I'm gonna go back. There's a house over there. There is a house over there. Oh my gosh. I didn't even see it. Oh, there's a cave. Oh no, it's just like two blocks. Never mind. I need to find a way. How did I not realize that there's a villager house right above my hole in the ground? I don't even know. I wonder what's in it. I hope there's a chest and I'm not just running towards something that's not there. Because I don't really want to waste my time. But I guess it can't hurt because I need to go back to the base anyways. And it's right above the base. I'll, I'm, I'll, I might have to tear it down to put my house. Because I kind of want to put a house over there. Maybe like an in-between base's house. I don't know. But I want to make a big base. 
Like, I want to make a, uh, I going to find a swamp and then make, like, a huge city in the swamp. And you guys might be like, why swamp? Um, why not a swamp, honestly? Swamps are neglected because they're nasty looking things, but I kind of like building in swamps. Like a little village that kind of was like, why did we build here? I don't know. Oh, it has two doors. It's a fancy house. It's a really fancy house. I'm going to go up onto the top of this mountain and see what I see, because I hope that the um, spruce wood forest doesn't go on for much longer, and it looks like it might. Oh, no. Oh, my lord. There's another village over there. Um, the cedar will also be in the description if you guys want to know. Actually, it'll be on the screen, too, right here. There you go. That's a seed. Um, I will have to check that out maybe in the next episode. I am not sure. Um, oh, there's caves right here. I'm gonna have to check these out real quickly. Oh, no, they aren't caves. They're literally just, like, surface indents, which I guess is a cave anyways, but... Interesting. Alright, um, I'm gonna go back to my little base hobbit hole. Not even a hobbit hole, just a hole. It doesn't look as nice as a hobbit hole. Those things are... I wouldn't mind living in a hobbit hole. Okay. Um, leather stuff. I know if my friend was playing with me, he'd absolutely love it. He's obsessed with making leather gear. And I have everything except uh, boots, which I almost have because I have one leather, actually. Can you make a saddle and then get... No, you can't. It's just a saddle. Oh, well. I guess it's all right. Um, okay, I guess after this I'm gonna start collecting some wood. Um, so I'm just gonna, yeah, I guess I'll collect some wood, um, right now. I'll just cut to me having it in my inventory. Okay, so we got 37 spruce logs, because I like the idea of having my house kind of go in between spruce logs, um, spruce planks for maybe the roof. Or slabs, actually. Slabs kind of go a bit better for um, not a super steep roof, which doesn't really go along with this area. And then for the walls, some places just spruce planks and some places just regular old cobblestone. Nothing really special, but then again, it's nighttime and I just need um, maybe a bit somewhere a bit better sleep because i don't think i'm really enjoying sleeping in a hole and i almost died i am uh just be a bit more careful i don't really want to die this early i mean this is only the second day after all so i'm gonna sleep and i'm gonna find a good place to start the walls i guess tomorrow okay so now that we're done sleeping we are going to go up into the mountains because i want to build it fairly close to here but I don't think I want to build my base close to here. I actually, I don't really know what I want to do with my base. And how in the world did I get up last time? Oh, I did some really cool hardcore parkour stuff. There I go. And, I'm, yeah, I'm not really sure. I don't really want to build a sky base. I'm going to build a town. Yeah, I'm going to build a town. I kind of just forgot I was going to do a town. And I was like, what am I going to do for my main big base? But... I forgot I was going to do a town. And that happens sometimes when I'm recording. My brain and my mouth just don't really correlate with each other super good. And we're just kind of mush right out. But I'm looking for a good spot. And I'm not looking for like huge just amounts of flat spaces. And I don't want to do too much clearing. Because this is supposed to be an easy in between house house. I'm thinking maybe like right there. I think that would work just good. So I'm gonna go down there with my spruce logs and kind of make an outline of what um, the home will consist of. And the home will have a basement. I forgot to tell you guys that, but. So we're gonna maybe go in there. Also here. That goes in there. And over here, that has like a mudroom entrance door. And then the other side will kind of come out over here to there. And then over here, that will come out to here. And we're going to clear just a little bit out. So it's not cramming it against the side of this dirt hill. And then this will come in maybe a couple blocks, I guess. 
I have to go out, and it's kind of gonna zigzag in and out like so until this comes right over here and plops right there. That looks pretty good, and we're just kind of make that so it's not right on the edge because that doesn't look too pretty. So then I guess we're going to build all of these up three more because I like my ceilings a little bit higher so they're not just above my head and I can jump and not hit my head. So we're going to do that and then we're going to make a roof. Um, I think all that we're going to have time for today, I don't know, I'm going to edit the video to an extent right now. Or actually no, I'm going to build all of these up and yeah, we're going to see how it looks with all of these up. This I'm kind of concerned will look a bit smushed but... We'll see how it looks. Okay, so I got all of them set in, and it doesn't necessarily look quite like a house yet. Um, ooh, I'm gonna take you, if my pickaxe doesn't break. I'm gonna take as many as my pickaxe will allow me, actually. Oh. Nice, um, I guess that's all I'm gonna take then. Um, I'm gonna have to do some cobblestone mining, getting resources kind of stuff. And I'm going to have to get more spruce to finish this up. But I think that's where this video is going to end. Um, sorry if this was short. And I'm sorry for not uploading quite a lot. Uh, just school started and then life happened. So, But I'm going to be um, doing this more because one, I really like the name. Hashtag Comic Craft. And hopefully YouTube either won't notice that it's called that or won't care that it's called that but if they do then I'll change the name to Kermitcraft because why not and I'm gonna kill myself if I keep doing this so I better end the video now before you guys see me die in a very very stupid way so thank you guys for watching and I hope you enjoyed this video I'll see you guys in the next one and I'm not sure how long this video is gonna be I think it'll probably be like 10 minutes long but I don't know. I don't have a lot of time today. Um, so yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys.